the center fielder, number 24, Jared Kelly. The pitch. And that one a little below the knees. And this one is off and running. Foul ball there. The pitch. Swings through that. One ball, two strikes. Swing and a ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. So a man on base to start the inning. Once you get the ball by the pitcher, there's a lot of base hits up the middle, even on ground balls. So a nice job to use that big hole and get himself a hit. Ozzy Albies up to the plate. That one's in there. 0-1. Albies is playing on the road, so you know that means he's been FaceTiming with his pet fish. This guy owns a few home aquariums, and it's no secret he likes talking to his fish when he's away. In fact, Albies had cameras installed so he can check on the fish anytime he wants. And he'll two. Ball on there. That's a really good job of laying off the 0-2 high fastball. Is going to make that pitcher really have to respect this hitter, even though he's behind in the count. Got him swinging. Here's Marcelo Zuna. Check swing, and that's a ball. And now the lefty. Big ball. swing and a miss. One ball, one strike. Ball. Next offering upstairs. Kelman, the runner at first with one gone in the inning. Wouldn't ball. chase that time. Here it comes. And that's, that's ball, ball four. Take your base. First and second, one out. Matt Olson next up for the Braves. Oops. And that's through there for a strike. The last thing he wants is to hit the ball on the ground, but I wouldn't expect many pitches up in the zone. They'll be pitching for a double play in this spot. Runners at first and second with one gone, and we're just getting started here in the top of the first. A little no, bit low. That's the ball. We're going to lay off that pitch down. 1-1. One, one. And fouled off. Definitely got the hitter conscious of the pitch inside. Really think the outer half is open. To the right side. And foul he grabs ball. it in foul ground. Runners at first and second with one gone. On the ground, two ball. Off balance beat, there's one. What a double play that was. Inning over. And stepping in for the Yankees, Anthony Volpe. Not shortstop. Line and pitch. Swing and a tapper that rolls foul. Freed, a multi gold glove award winner. He features a four seam fastball, a curb. A changeup, a sinker, and he works in a slider. And down on strikes, and one gone. Here's Juan Soto. He's got the power, but great contact skills. One of the best contact hitters in the game. And that's in the dirt. We talk so much about how starting pitchers prepare for their starts. I talked with Max Breed, and one of the things he told me back in 19, he and Lucas Giolito started using MLB the show to go over scouting reports right through there for a strike Max said he's one not ball. sure one who strike. actually started at first but it was 2019 and he and Giolito who were team oh this one high and deep way back there to the warning track makes the catch two outs bases empty Aaron Judge stepping in now for the Yankees and Judge spoils that one. Two outs. Swing and a miss. 
This guy's pounding the zone. Hitters don't have time to think in between pitches. Now fly ball to right center. Loriano trying to get there. Makes the catch. And the inning is over. And welcome back to the ballpark. Here's the third baseman, Austin Riley. As the lefty gets to work. Riley is one of those players that made his presence known in the majors right away. He hit a 438-foot home run off of Michael Walker fastball on his second at bat, which is probably the best way to make a first impression as a rookie, boo. Soto gets under it. And there's one down. Adam Duvall at the plate. Duvall, a former All-Star, batting sixth in today's lineup. Usually in center field, but today starting in left. In there for strike one. One thing I always felt if I played left field instead of center field ball. was that the ball gets out there to you pretty one quick. One. And the most important play is that ball down the left field line. Getting to it, cutting it off, making a strong throw to keep that single instead of turning it into a double. One down, base is empty. Spoils a two-strike pitch, and he'll see another. And a ball and two strikes. Keeps the at-bat going with a foul ball. The line of the pitch. Good oh, eye no. in that spot. It's a good take. That oh. one misses, and that's ball okay. three. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. He circles the bases. It's 1-0. One, one down. So here's Murphy now. Bounced up the middle. Torres handles. Safe at first as they can't make the play. Here's Orlando Arcia. No. First pitch misses. One ball, no strike. Murphy stands at first with one out. Swings through that one above the zone. One good fastball, particularly for young hitters, can be hard to lay off of because you see it so well at the oh, level. Dude. It's really hard to catch up and get that top hand to work on time. Loriano comes up to hit. Swing and a ball hit out towards left center field. Verdugo makes the grab, and that's the inning. Back at Yankee Stadium, bottom of the second. So now the Yankees cleanup hitter, Alex Verdugo. And a pitch. Just missed. Next offering in there for a strike. And one and one. And he deals. There's the swing and a miss. Good pitch down one around ball. the knees. You want to be there all game. In a park like this, a pop-up sometimes will carry out. That one in the dirt. Two and two. And another ball. And there's Take ball four. Ball That's four. a great at bat. He saw a lot of pitches and earned a walk. John Carlos Stanton to the plate now. Outfield play very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. Swing in a miss. And it's a one one. And that's outside. Home team down a run. Bottom half of inning number two. And that one fouled off. The two strikes may see some movement over there at first base. Trying to stay out of the double play right here. 
not two, two. close with that one. And that's ball two. Wouldn't okay. chase that time. Still just the second batter of the inning. And on the mound, he's already thrown 13 pitches. They got him working hard out there. Puts it away for the out. Now it's LeMay who up to hit. The first well, definitely wants to stay out of the double play here. Ball on the ground in the oh, infield. Should be an inning ending double play. Rudder takes off. Liner, base hit. Lead runner around second. And they'll have runners at the corners after a one out single. Well, clearly he was ready to hit right there. Hooked around that pitch on the outside, but he was still able to square it up pretty nicely. And that takes a quick, strong wrist to pull that off. Glaber uh -huh. Torres in the box now. Take strike one. Right through there for a strike. Big pitch right here. He's going to try to make a pitch that's going to produce a strikeout or a ground ball double play. Lefty out of the stretch. Runners at first and third. Swing and a miss struck him out. Batting it. And next for New York, Oswaldo Cabrera. A switch hitter batting right. On the ground to third. Over to Albies. Third out. Back in New York. Top half of the third inning. Here's Jerry Kelvin. Cortez back to work. Hard ground ball, base now. Man aboard on the leadoff single. The batter out of the Second base. Here is Ozzy Albies up to him. He was a strikeout victim his first time. In the air, right side. Squeezes it. So here's the Braves designated hitter, Marcelo Zuna, walked his first time. That's in there. That's strike one. Man, I mean, nice job just presenting it to be better than it actually was. Checks over to first, back safely. Now the 0-1. A little out front there as he swings through. Oh, and he really right. sells the changeup with that arm action. Go. Gonna count one and two. Really good take, especially with two strikes. At the belt and fires. Swings oh. and misses, struck him out. Matt Olson up to the plate. He hit into a double play his first time up. And the pitch a little bit low, ball one. That one not close, and that's ball two. Right through there for a strike. RBI spot here. Just got to stay focused on the pitch. The runner will be in motion, so something in the gap should definitely score. Fights it off. You'll see another. Two outs. Fouled off again. And it remains three and two. Left hand batter waits. So One now more. two on and two outs. It wasn't easy, but he earned that walk after a long at bat. So first and second with two outs. Austin Riley next up for the Braves. That one in there across the letters. Next offering popped in the air, right field. Soto gets under it and makes the grab. And that is that.
set for the bottom of the we third. Go. Here's Jose Trevino. Trevino. This guy, one of the best oh, defensive yeah. catchers going. You talk about framing, the ability to block, catch, and throw. He is at the top of the game. And That's the first the pitch misses for ball one. Really good athlete. And many times we talk about, you know, the feet of infielders. This catcher as well, really quick feet. He's able to recognize the pitch, see the trajectory, and get into a spot where he can block those balls and keep them from going to the backstop. Oh, bad, bad, bad. Everything came together for him. It's hard to hit a baseball much better than that. And even a lot of professional hitters aren't able to reach an exit below of 114 miles per hour. I'll tell you what, that's a very impressive swing of the bat. And a 1 0. And a pop up, right side, foul territory. Calls it in for the out. And now it's Juan Soto. 0 for 1 with a fly out to center. Go, go, go. I thought this was a fun note on Soto. In 2023, he hit home runs in Mexico, Canada, and the U.S. I don't think it matters where Solo plays. He's going to hit home runs everywhere he goes. And a foul ball makes the count two and one. Left-hand hitter waits. That misses. And a count is three and one. Last couple of pitches, breaking balls away. I think he's going to have to come firm inside to be able to open up oh, that oh, location if he wants to go back there later in this count. Well, interesting. He went with the off speed. <laughs> and you got to challenge the guy with the fastball. Judge in the box now. Take strike one. Really good job in this spot to get ahead in the count. He's going to have to continue finish off this hitter. Next pitch misses inside. And the count is one and one. You don't want to get beat by a fastball in. And he spits on that one. Clips the corner. And the count one and two. And another ball. And the curve misses outside. That's a really good take. Up the middle. Over to Albies. Double play. What a twin killing to end the inning. New inning getting started. So now to the plate for Atlanta. Adam Duvall. Here comes a pitch. In the air, right field. Soto makes the grab. One pitch and one out. Here's Sean Murphy. Reached on an infield single his first time. Sean Murphy. Singing four homers in 22 games at Old Yankee Stadium. What do you remember? Well, I remember my rookie year hitting two in one game. And, you know, before that game in the clubhouse, there was a gentleman there who owned a suit company there in downtown Manhattan. And he said to me, hey, kid, you hit a home run in the game tonight. Come over to the store tomorrow, and I'll give you a free suit. And that's in the dirt. And the count is two and two. So I went into the game. I happened to hit two. When I walked into the store the next day, and he looked at me, he said, you're trying to put me out of business, aren't you? And that was a great the great experience that I had as a rookie playing against the Yankees playing in New York. Arcia in the box now as he looks at ball one. Second plate appearance of the day for him. That one finds the zone and it's a ball to strike. So did Super Joe give you two suits? Super Joe hooked me up with two suits. Two down, nobody on. Wouldn't okay. chase that time. Swing and a foul back. That's out of play. Really great change of speeds. He goes off the off speed to the fastball, and the hitter doesn't know what's coming next. Cabrera drifts towards it. Hauls it in to end the inning. And we're back. Bottom four. Here's Alex Verdugo. No left field. Why to kick the pitch? And that one.
one upstairs. He's been pitching well, but we'll see what kind of adjustment the hitters make this second time through the order. We'll know if he's got really good stuff in this one or not. Ball upstairs. The 2 2. Knocks that one away, and we'll do it again. The 2 2. Gets a piece and stays alive. Another ball. Now in this three ball count, okay. down in the ball game, you've got to be very selective. Take your walk if they'll give it to you. Kicks and deals. Foul ball, and it remains a full count. And a pitch. Line drive, and it foul goes ball. just foul. Payoff pitch. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. Got it by him for the K. John Carlos Stanton at the plate. Over for one. Popped out foul to the catcher his first time off. There's a strike. Oh one. Right through there for a strike. Well, we call that keyhole. Even though it's right there and looks pretty good, if he doesn't love it, he's not going to swing that early in the count. Yeah, that skips in the dirt. Fouls it off, still one and two. And that's in the dirt. One out, base is empty. In the air, out towards left center. He's got it. Two away. That's just a really nice catch no, on no, the no. run right no, there. No. He saved extra bases yeah. for sure. If the pitcher's his friend, he'll give him a second to catch his breath before he's ready to deal the next pitch. LeMay uh -huh. stands in now and watches strike one. Chases that one. And it's a three up, three down inning. Ready now for the fifth inning. Now in for the Braves. Ramon Laureano. Ramon Laureano. And a pitch. Laureano goes five feet, 11 inches, 205 pounds, and he was born in the Dominican Republic. And a pitch. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. So the lineup flips over, and next for Atlanta, Jared Kelman. Base is empty, one away, and we're at the top of the fifth. He's been going after these guys consistently, and as a result, oh, he's been able to keep his pitch count low. Throwing the ball very well right now. Ball one. Just off the outside corner. Ball one. Soft contact in the air, and that's a base hit. So a man aboard now with one away. Hey, whatever works, right? Doesn't have to be impressive. No, no, no. On the mound, he's got to feel like he deserved a better result on that pitch. Really, I mean, just a soft liner that happened to stay fair, but... Runner takes off. Swing in the miss. Over. Pro save. High leg kick hangs in the air, but he read it nicely. And now in scoring position to add on to this lead. Swing and a miss. Ugly swing right there. Talk about tying a guy up. That was ugly. Foul ball still 0 and 2. One out and a runner at second. Oh, 
There's a swing and a drive. This looks like extra bases headed for the plate. He'll score, and they lead by two. Comes through with the RBI. Didn't try to do too much with it. Just a really controlled, simple swing. You don't see a whole lot of that these days with guys trying to launch and hit home runs, but sometimes you got to shorten up just like that. Ah. Ozuna, batting with one down, takes no a strike. What strike? And it's second. And it's quickly nothing in two okay. by the designated hitter. Ground ball left side. Throws the first in time. Here's Matt Olson. He's all for one. Just missed. Albies stands at second with two gone. Not Whoa. even close there. Two balls, no strikes. Ball and delivers outside. outside. Get ready for some action here. Good RBI guy at the plate. Runners in scoring position. And a hitter's count. And he Ball walked four. him. Second walk of the game for him, and he's been really patient at the play. The game plan that he's sticking to is just not going outside of what he's looking for up there. And a foul ball. Late that time, it's strike two. I think he's set up speed there. and misses. It's a strikeout. Back now in the Bronx. Go. Bottom of the Blazer. inning. Here's Glaber Torres. The, second base. Blazer. the wide of the pitch. Ball. Wouldn't chase that time. You know, these Yankees oh, no. did a great job, Boog, of just waiting for the right pitch to come their way. And I'm seeing very yeah. patient at bats out of them. One Starter's ball. leash One has strike. to be getting tighter with his pitch count where it is, but so far, he's been really effective in this one. Next offering is in for a strike. You know, sometimes it just takes getting to the bullpen in order to be able to score runs, and that might be the case today. Fights that one away, still one and two. And another ball. The punch out there, and the leadoff hitter retired in the fifth. Oswaldo Cabrera, the next to hit. Cabrera. Rolled softly, but that goes foul. One down, base is empty. Got a good eye there. The 1-1 one -one is fouled off. You could see he was trying to stay back long enough to handle the off-speed pitch, but just a little tardy on the fastball. Yeah, there's the ball. The 2-2 two -two now. Spoils the two-strike pitch, and he'll see another. The Yankees trailing by two. Last half of inning number five stays alive. In the Full dirt. Count. Full count now. Good plate One appearance more. there. Able to take the walk. That's a great yeah, at bat. He saw a lot of pitches and earned a walk. Jose Trevino will hit next. One for one with a single so far. To short, could be two. Takes it to the bag, that's one. On to Olsen, that's two. Back for more from the Bronx. Top of the sixth inning at the play. Adam Duvall. Cortez back to work. And that's in for a strike. For you growing up in New York City, I mean, you're a big sports fan. Tell me about your experience. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there. On a 
its way. Gone. Another homer. His second home run of the game, and they boost their lead. It's 3 0. Nope. New pitcher on here, number 50. Nope. Just trying to keep this one close here, and this is where a bullpen can give their players a chance to fight back into the game. So now to the plate for Atlanta, Sean Murphy, one for two. First pitch just misses. Always exciting to see a leadoff home run in an inning. Kind of gets the offense fired up and you start to expect a big inning. Righty delivers. Ball. And it is two and one. On the ground right side ball. and that's just foul. And Look another out. ball. Nobody on. Nobody out with a run in. And we're in the top half of the sixth. Righty to the plate. That one ripped. And that's a base hit. Makes the turn and heads for second. And he greets the new arm from the bullpen with a double. Everything came together perfectly for him right there. When you connect and it jumps off your bat like that, you're thinking double at the very least. What a great swing on it. And, man, he wasn't fooled at all. And now it's going to be Orlando Arcia. Garcia started after it, tried to hold up. Now a look to first, and he held up. Fouled off. He was late. Here's a 1-1. Late swing, fouled off. The one two. two two Murphy leads off second with nobody out Ooh. swing and a miss struck him out here's Ramon Laureano the bottom of the order here Bill you gotta go Laureano. right after this guy as they look to pick up an add-on run and the number nine guy at the plate just missed a two seam fastball is usually coupled with a slider away and when a hitter is conscious of the pitch in it's hard for him to cover middle away and that's where a pitcher can really finish off One that more. batter man at second and right back to the mound tosses Out. to first and Loriano is retired so the batting order turns over, and now the center fielder, Jared Kelman, three for three with three singles. And there's a foul ball. Runner at second, two down. Hit well, right field, way back. It's their second home run of the inning, and they throw a pair on the board. It's five zip. So two away with nobody on. And now, Ozzy Albies, one for three. Ball. First pitch doesn't find the zone. One ball, no strike. Swing and a ball popped up, moving under it. And puts the squeeze on that one. And that is that. Back in the Bronx. Go. Here we go bottom six. Stepping in, Anthony Volpe. Anthony. 
the pitch. They've got a potent lineup. And when you think about teams capable of rallying from this kind of deficit, they're right at the top of the list. Next offering in there for a strike. Strike one. Ball, one strike. The, the shortstop ball. takes a ball. And a 2-1 on the way. And a foul ball. Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. Now bad. Right field. Juan Soto now. Soto reached 500 walks faster than anyone in baseball history. This guy is a once-in-a-generation type player. Inside corner, and that's called a strike. Oh one. And it's fouled away. Gets a piece, and it stays 0-2. Well struck right field. Tattooed and gone. And they're on the board. It's 5-1. It's a one out, nobody on. Aaron Judge stepping in now for the Yankees. That one's in there on one. Part of the order coming through now, and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. The Braves leading by four here in the bottom of the sixth. Next oh, offering dude. in there for a strike. And that's strike oh, two. two. One down, base is empty. Cuts oh. and misses. It's a strikeout. And next will be the cleanup hitter, Alex Verdugo. A strikeout and a walk. The other way. Makes the catch in and over. Welcome back. We're in the seventh. We have a new pitcher on the mound, Cody Pochi. Now pitcher for the New York Yankees. Number 72, Cody. So here's the Braves designated hitter, Marcelo Zuna. The designated hitter, Marcelo Zuna. The pitch. There's a high chopper, Volpe. Slings to first. Ow. One up, one down. Here is Matt Olson. Really nice job to get your first out of the ball game. And immediately pumps in a strike to the left-handed hitter. And he grounds one to the right side. Toss to LeMayhew. Two up, two down. Here's Austin Riley. 0 for 3 with two flyouts and a strikeout. Hit on the ground to the right side. And it's a 1-2-3 inning for the Braves. Back at Yankee Stadium, ready to go for the last half of the inning. And now the DH, Giancarlo Stanton. The lefty fires. And first offering is fouled off. The Yankees looking to rally. The pitch. And no, that's, that's off the inside edge. One ball, one strike. Ooh. And a swing and a miss. The lefty closing in on 100 pitches. Battling here as he fouls it away. Ball Wouldn't two. chase that time. Two ball, two strikes. Swing and a miss. Adam out front for the strikeout. Up now here's DJ LeMayhew. The first base. DJ LeMayhew. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. One down, base is empty. 
and it's one and one. One one. The pitch. Sets him down looking. Buckled him with the backdoor breaking ball for strike three. Two outs, bases empty. And up next for New York, Glaber Torres, who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. Going one. No ball, one strike. And that skips in the dirt. Just outside. off the outside edge, ball two. Right ball through there three. for a strike. Two outs, bases empty. Ball that three. misses, and the count's full. Ball down. That's foul off to the right side, keeps the A.B. going. Two outs. Now a high fly ball out to left center. Duvall sizes this one up, makes the grab, and that'll end the inning. All set for the start of the inning. And now Adam Duvall. And here it comes. Pote goes six foot one, 29 years old. He joined the team as a free agent. The 1-0. And ball another two. ball. Right-handed reliever. Three. Way out front for strike two. two, two. Oh, and now it's oh. filled up. Kind of break right there. Oh, Pretty yeah. good pitch on the outside corner. And he deals. Swing and a ball driven pretty well out towards left center. Judge is there. And there's one down. Here's the catcher, Sean Murphy. He's built his reputation as one of the top framers in the sport. Murphy. And first offering is fouled off. One down, base is empty. And that one hammered Verdugo. Going back. Jumps, but it's off his glove. In safely with a double, his second of the day. Couldn't have timed it up any better than that. Just missed out on a home run right there, but he certainly hit it hard enough. Just didn't have the right launch angle to carry it over the wall, but still an excellent swing of the bat. Arcia, the next to hit, takes ball one. Hit hard, that gets through into third now. So runners at the corners and one out. He was all over that one. Not much to this one other than just a willingness to go the other way and put the ball in play. That's a team at bat right there. Nice job of staying back and letting the ball get deep. Now it's going to be Ramon Laureano. Two on, one out. Swings through that one for strike one. One ball, one strike. And he swings and lifts one to deep center field. Judge ranging back. Just side of the wall. And that should get the job done as he tags from third. That's a sacrifice fly as he comes across. It's 6-1. Jared Kelman digs in now. He's already homered in this game. Swinging a foul over the screen and back out of play. Ball. Next offering misses, and that's ball one. 
And strike two. Man, he was One, really two. tardy on that fastball. Great job of setting him up by throwing the curveball. Add some velocity to it on the next pitch. Can't catch up. It gets down. Base hit. Throw stops the lead runner at second. Two on and two out. I mean, come on. Have a game. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. Two on, two outs. That one's in there, and it's 0-2. This guy's so comfortable hitting with two strikes, even a good pitch early in the at-bat. If he's not ready to pull the trigger, He's not worried if he gets to an 0-2 count. Two outs. That one the other way. Low throw, and he can't take it out. And next is the designated hitter, Marcelo Zuna. Marcelo Zuna. Slider misses outside. And there's a rocket into the outfield. One run is in. Now two runs score. And they're pulling away up by seven now. Nicely done. Brings home two. They hand the ball over to a new arm. Ron Marinaccio. I think it's got to be a little tough coming in out of the pen when your guys are trailing so big on the scoreboard. Just doesn't have the same intensity to it, but he's got to find a way because these batters count the same for his stats, obviously, regardless of the score. And now Matt Olson up to hit. And a foul ball. Albies, the runner at third. Ozuna at first, two out of the inning. No. Just off the inside edge. That's a good miss off the inside part of the plate. You'd much rather miss there than out over the plate where this guy could do some real damage. Kicks and fires. Good and good. another ball. On the ground. Dives, but it kicks off his glove. To first, it, and he beats it. it. Everyone's safe. Puts a run on the board and picks up an RBI. That's one of those you classify as just too hot to handle. Hit it on the screws, and it couldn't be fielded cleanly, but you can't really blame the defense in that case. Riley in the box with two gone, and takes a look at a called strike. And that's off the inside edge. And that's ball one. There's a strike. One ball. Two strikes. Got him swinging. Back now, new pitcher on the mound as we roll into the bottom of the eighth. Jesse Chavez. And you know, bullpen guys can struggle sometimes when they're called upon with big leads because it just doesn't have the same intensity as a tight game. So we'll see how sharp he is. Your mental toughness matters in situations like go. this as well. So digging in, Oswaldo Cabrera. Cabrera. And a pitch. Ball. And that's off the inside edge. Ball one. That clips a corner. Look at that right here. He did the team thing, took until he got a strike. Now he's got to go to work, shorten up that swing a little bit, do whatever it takes to get on base. The 1-1 one -one is fouled off. No. Next offering is downstairs. Two ball, two strike. Down the line. Reaches over the wall, and he's got it! Jose Trevino getting ready to hit. Ball, First pitch high. misses. And ball another two. ball. The Braves up big in this one. Here, the bottom half of the eighth inning. 
and pitch in for a strike. Now two and one. In today's game, not that many fastball counts, but hitters still in the back of their minds, they're looking for one. Two will change up call right there. Excellent pitch selection to go with. Murphy pulls it down, and there's two gone. The batter no, 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 back no, 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 to the top no, no. of the Yankee no, no. order. Anthony and Volpe today. stepping in now for the Yankees. Volpe. foul ball ball, and ball one Hurry. swing and a miss and he is down on strike and welcome back to the ballpark. And now, Adam Duvall. Adam Duvall. Marinaccio back to work. Oh. That one missed. Ah. Right through there for a strike. One, two now. Ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. And the leadoff man aboard. Having himself a really nice game at the plate. Really nice job staying up the middle with his approach. He didn't try to do too much with the pitch. Just shot it through the infield. Now no. here is Sean Murphy. right there you want to get something just a little higher that you can elevate stay out of that double play grounder might be two beats the He's second up. out there puts the tag on him and it's a double play two outs base is empty Orlando Arcia next up for the Braves a swing and a miss and that's strike one oh one Right side, hard hit. Torres fires out. over to first. And that's the third out. Bottom nine. And stepping in for the Yankees, Juan Soto. And the right hater back to work. Yeah. Fast ball for a strike. 0-1. And that one pulled foul. Right hander kicks deals. Oh. Ball one there. Next pitch misses way outside. And the right hander deals. Oh. He goes down looking. Three. Aaron Judge no, at the plate. No, 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 0 for 3. A fly out of ground Aaron, out and a strikeout. Yeah. And the first one. pitch misses for ball one. Ball. And another ball. The Yanks with a lot of ground to make up. We're in the last half of the ninth inning. That one misses, and it's 3 0. Oh. And that's in there at the knees. One down, base is empty. And yeah, Judge takes a strike. Yeah, there's That's ball the ball. four. Take you know, bait. I think he's okay with that outcome. It, it wasn't an intentional walk, but he wasn't lose. exactly Double trying to attack his own either. One gone runner at first. Good Alex job. Verdugo stepping in now for the Yankees. There's a strike. Judge leads off first with one away.
Going to now. And that one ripped to left. And that's a fair ball. Lead runner makes the turn at second. Lead runner holds at third. So two runners in scoring position and just one out. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the barrel straight to it. That's great work right there. And the righty deals. Oh. That misses the zone, and now it's even one, one and one. one Swing and a miss, and that's strike two. One, two. Two on, one out. Ball and two. another ball. ball now three. it's three and two. Full count. Struck ah, him out ooh. without a swing. Yankees with only one out remaining. Up, up, up. And now it's DJ LeMayhew digging in. DJ LeMayhew. That's the ball. ball. One to LeMayhew. One ball. No strike. Yep. In there at the knees. One one. Two outs, two in scored position here in the last half of inning number nine. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. And a foul ball, he stays alive. One strike away. That's ball. inside. It's two and two. Two ball, two strike. Next okay. offering is outside. Eighth pitch of the at bat coming up. Oh. Now, and Ooh. that is the ball game. Got a big win by eight runs. And when you have that kind of lead, do you make it easier for the pitching staff to come out, make their pitches, pitch to contact, and not worry about giving up the lead? So nice job today all the way around to get the W. 9-1 is how it ends. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chomley. Thanks for joining us.